morning everybody it's a new day welcome back to the channel glad y'all come stop back by uh fix some pull out of here i think it's called carney's night at carney's point it's old man oldman's township here on 95 i said last night got about an hour up to our first drop traffic looks good on the, the google map so far we'll see how much it's fibbing to us uh, slide up there Kick the first stop off. It's the biggest stop that I have on a whole lot. So, kick it off. And then try to take that one box over to Long Island. Uh, see if we can't get something done today. Other than fight traffic. So, y'all go along for the ride. I think I'm going to try to set my camera up whenever I get up here to New Jersey. Or up here to my first stop. Um, now would be a good time to subscribe to the channel if you ain't already. So, other than that, guys, catch you on the next update. Oh, it's hot. I didn't get to get any footage. I got the first stop off. I'm hurrying here. I'm going to try to make it as fast as I can across this town. Uh, like I said, this is the Northeast, so do the best we can. Got most of my load off on that stop. I got, I've got one box going over here. Um, it'll just be a quick stop and go, um, hopefully. So... I'll check back up with you once I get out of Long Island, probably. I'll have to stop take a 30-minute break, more than likely. So, I'll check back in with you. Otherwise, y'all be careful. All right, first trip on the island. Not bad at all. Um, I got my one box off. I'm going to try to get back out of the city before it gets crazy. Get off the island. Not a bad place. Uh, I'm sure it can get kind of crazy. I've heard stories. So, I'm going to try to get my navigational beacons pointing towards Louisville and I'll grab a 30 minute break here in a little while and we'll check back in see where we're at be careful now Whoo! yeah been a day been a day I have made it to Somerset Pennsylvania gonna I had uh, I didn't have very much time left on my clock when I got here uh, I'm a little pull off here off of Pennsylvania Turnpike and it was getting getting down to the wire I, I was able to push on through though and found me a good good open area here couple other trucks there'll be more in the morning whenever I wake up so I've got roughly 460 miles to my next stop I'm hoping that they don't stop real early I'm hoping that I'm able to unload it tomorrow took a little longer up there coming back out of Long Island there I didn't, when I stopped to take the 30 minute break, I didn't, um, I didn't do an update because like, I mean, I was just, I was gone. I, I ate real quick and I was gone, um, trying to fight the clock before traffic got real crazy, uh, worse than it was, and I, I barely made it to that through there before rush hour so but we made it and i guess we'll see what happens tomorrow said i'm hoping that i'm able to get that one off um, if not see what happens the next day so we're gonna give it our best shot like we always do i end up running i think i had a pretty good day considering where i traveled i mean it was just a little over 500 miles today and I personally, I think dealing with New Jersey and New York, you know, city, Long Island, I think it's pretty good. I've stayed after it. So, been a good day. Good day. We still have all our truck parts attached and nobody got hurt. So, hopefully, hopefully, it won't be long before we can have some dash cam footage. I wasn't able to get up with a, a friend of mine to get 
the action camera. Uh, but more than likely, before I get um, get home, I'll either order one, have it there waiting, or I'll I will end up with one. Who knows? Uh, might have one tomorrow. Just depends on if I can get meet up with him or not. So I want to give a shout out to my good friend Joe Petrie there. He uh, he was the one told me not to the, the way to go into Long Island. He goes out there quite regular, and it was it was good. I mean, it worked out perfect. So appreciate that. And I believe it's time to go fix something to eat. Call it a night. Uh, last mile was the hardest. Ah, they wasn't that bad. Just long. So, other than that, I'll catch you guys on the next video tomorrow. Uh, if you want to see that, make sure you've clicked that notification bell. And just, just watch for them every day. Um, hopefully, we'll, like I said, we'll start getting... I'm getting a little more of a rhythm, getting a little more comfortable with the job. So, hopefully go back to doing... I was going to do some unloading videos today but with this headache rack i used to take the tripod that i've got and i would just put it down inside my tarps well on this headache rack if you've seen it in the video yesterday if you hadn't now would be a good time well after you get done this video go watch that one um but i can't it's got doors on it so I had the bright idea, hey, I'll put it on top of the headache rack. No, I can't reach the top. I didn't think about that. So, but hang in there. I'll get a system figured out to where I can give you all, you guys some actual good footage, not just me rambling on. Uh, but we'll get there. So, like the channel, share the channel, tell everybody about the channel subscribe to the channel i got a lot of people that watch the channel that are not subscribed if you're not subscribed you can't ring the notification bell if you don't ring the notification bell you don't know when i upload so be on the lookout for the next video it'll probably be this weekend i know i said i try to get a better walk around video uh it'll probably be this weekend when i do my 34 I uh, wish we'll I see how all that plays out because it's going to be a push for me to get to North Dakota and South Dakota to get my South Dakota off by Friday. So, but I'm going to give it every shot I got. Did I say that right? I'm going to give it everything I got to do it. Give it our best shot. There we go. So, guys, we'll catch you on the next update. Till then, y'all keep it between the ditches.